Alright, today is Friday the 11th. We are going to go to a really awesome Asian restaurant. I don't know what it's called. I think it's Legend of Asia. Legend of Asia, I think. After that, we're going to go to the Asian market. Uh, one of our friends, Matt, Andrew, introduced us to a really awesome little aloe drink. It's got like this fruity stuff with little bits of crap in it everywhere. It's awesome. But you guys get to see that. It's a really awesome place. Fun adventures for today. We have started on our adventure. It is raining outside a little bit, not too much. Jimmy's driving. Yo. That gives us about... 3% chance of survival. <laughs> I was going to say a 20% chance of surviving the trip. Uh, you, no, you survived the day. Yeah. Sean's going with us. What's up, losers? They're not losers, they're Sorry. wonderful. You survived Sedalia, so you should be okay. No. Jimmy, oh my god. Me and Jimmy were just getting done going to Walmart yesterday. And his dumbass decides to make almost a U-turn. I was not. Well he was not he wasn't a U-turn. He decided to turn. But only the turning lane stopped, so he was driving in the wrong lane of traffic for like 30 seconds. Oh my god, he tried to kill us. Two seconds, and now I'm He is the worst. I second this. He's a fucking crazy driver. He is. I am not And then, like, months and months ago, he almost pulled out in front of a semi truck. Because he's bad at driving. Yes, Jimmy. Tell them how bad at driving you are. I'm awesome in highway situations. No. No, you're not. Highway. Jimmy just got pulled over. Because he's a bad driver. Jimmy, why did you get pulled over? Because I didn't have a front plate. See? Bad driver. Example number three. Number three. More proof? Jimmy's a bad driver. He was just driving 25 miles an hour on the freeway. In the passing lane. In the passing lane. And he missed our ex exit. Jimmy, me. what is your excuse? We weren't saying anything when you missed the exit. Yeah, we weren't saying anything at all. I even told you about it after we passed it. No, he has no she's excuse. Just taking the shame. Shame! shame. Lots of shame! <laughs> we are almost at Blue Springs. Some timeline. We're going to show you their wonderful, wonderful development skills out here with like the houses right. and stuff. It's not very good. That'd be awesome. Yeah. There is a bank. And Jimmy's talking to Matt. Wild getting us while driving. Another example of bad driving. Another example of bad driving. I think this is number five, Sean. Five or six. This is number five or six. We'll continue counting. Screw you. Burning hell at that. Like up there, restaurant I want to eat at. It's like some kind of. Oh, what it was it called? The sushi bar, Mongolian barbecue, and Chinese. No, that one right there that I'm pointing the camera at. That's a restaurant? That big ass building is a restaurant, Jimmy. What is it? I can't remember. Well, it looks really good. That looks right like there. a bank to me. That's a bank. It wasn't a bank last week, goddammit. It was a restaurant. He even said it was a restaurant last week. But this is your crappy, crappy development. Oh, look at the flowers! Like, they've barely done anything out here because Blue Springs sucks. The only good thing about Blue Springs is their football team, their high school football team, and the Asian place we're going to go eat at. We are almost here. Now we've got to wait on cars to stop coming. 
Well, it's just a long ass line of cars. As long as that guy doesn't try to pull out. What? Jimmy's driving makes it extremely hard to record anything while in the car. Too busy fearing for your life. I am too busy fearing for my life. Okay. And you see that? That's like number seven example of bad driving. Sitting there pumping the brakes when you didn't need to. Horrible at this stuff. Bad driving. There's the sign. Really freaking bright out here. But it's beautiful inside. Ooh, pretty car. Ooh, that is a pretty car. Someone should buy that car for me. Huh? How much money do you have to spend last two days now? No idea. See, it's beautiful. Sushi bar right there. Tried sushi last time. Did not like it. Not good for me. But way over there is the... That's the guy that works for Warrensburg. He owns a Warrensburg Chinese restaurant. Him, right there. Sean is gonna try his first piece of sushi ever. It looks really disgusting, I'm not gonna lie. This is gonna be painful, isn't it? Just put it in your mouth. All of it. All of it. <laughs> Ew. Yeah, the polite thing would have been to put it in a napkin. What an animal. Let me repeat that. What did you just say? First off, you have to know that Sean was saying that he was going to get sick off the sushi. But I said that there's a bigger chance of me wrecking the car and him dying than him getting sick from the sushi. Does that scare you guys for my life? It scares me. Sean's driving home. It's been decided. So we are done eating. And a miracle just happened. I didn't even win the shotgun game, but Sean gave me the front seat. <laughs> Sean, why did you do this? So if we blew up, I'd have a chance of living. This car blows up, nobody's gonna live. We all just died. Huh? Hi. Well, we're not gonna go to the Asian market. It is apparently in Olathe. Overland Park. Overland Park, and we don't know how to get there. And then we'd have to find it, and we'd get lost, and... and give him a shitty vehicle to get lost in. Yeah, we, we didn't end up not making it home. So, we're going to save the Asian market for another day and another adventure.